many in the air? Thirteen, sir. How many can I carry? Four, sir. Robert Downey Jr. returns in Iron Man 3 as Tony Stark, whose world is torn apart by a formidable terrorist called the Mandarin. I'm Jared Kingery along with Kiko Martinez from Cinestop.net. So what do you think of Iron Man? Is it a giant popcorn movie? <laughs> well, let's first of all say that we're back on, you can see our beautiful faces now right, once yes. again. <laughs> well, yes. Iron Man, uh, let me tell you what I liked about it. Okay. I like Tony Stark. I like, everyone uh, loves everyone loves Robert Downey Jr. Robert Downey Jr. Right. Great. He's uh, fantastic again in this role. Uh, he has some great one-liners. Mm -hmm. um, the CGI and the um, the uh, action sequences are great. That was a pretty epic action, that, action that, sequence. That, that was. Air Force One. Um, I just couldn't get on board with the story. Uh, really? I was kind of disappointed with the two villains. I really hated the twist. I won't give anything oh, away. Don't, there is a twist. Don't give it away. Don't I give it away. I disliked it completely. Really, really, yes. really, 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 really. Okay. Uh, <laughs> now, people. Everyone saw the Avengers last year. Is right. this a worthy follow-up? Do you think? You know, I think it is. But uh, like you've said in, in, a, in a past review, that it, it's a standalone film. Uh, this right. really felt like it was by itself, and it could really. Uh, you, you, know. you do kind of wonder, like, hey, why isn't the Hulk helping him out this time? Right. Exactly. But I, I think this is a, a, a good stepping stone for another one. All right. What's your grade for this one? I'm giving this a C plus. A C plus. That is actually lower than the critical average of a B. All right. Remember, before you head out to the theater this weekend, be sure to check out the rest of our reviews here on WOAI dot com.